I'm so excited to be taking part in this experiment. We can find out if love is truly blind. I've had some difficulties finding love in my life. Some say I have commitment issues, but I think that's just what my therapist says and what everyone else in my life says. And here they said I could possibly find the person that I'm going to get, get married to. And that's crazy. Damn. And if I end up engaged, I can go to Mexico with the sand and the sun, really nice hotel, and getting all my meals paid for, and not having to think about work for a little while. Just some me time. I mean, us time, because I will be there with my fiance, and we will definitely be together and not separately at all. I'm not here just for a vacation, I swear. Oh my gosh. This room is so cute. So because you're my first date, I decided to dress really cute for you. And it doesn't even matter because you can't see me. Oh, yeah. I just don't see the point of dressing up anymore. All these women are dressing to the nines every single day. And yet, uh, they can't see you. It's like there's no point. Like, yeah, there's a camera guy there. We're in those rooms for hours on end talking with these dudes. I want to be comfortable. Is that too much of a problem? Is that too crazy? You're not gonna show these to the guys after we meet, right? Like, I wanna have a shot. Okay, cool, thanks. Thanks. So, um, tell me about yourself. No, no, please tell me more about your parents' divorce. I really wanna, I really wanna hear about it. What? Oh, yeah. I found it really fascinating um, why your parents divorced is the reason you can't find love. So tell me about your past relationships. This guy is so boring. More fun? Haha. <laughs> you can't eat. No, I wasn't talking to you. Sorry. No, no, keep, keep talking though. No, I didn't just burp. What's your favorite snack food? Do you have any siblings? If you could travel anywhere, where would you go? It's so strange to be talking to a wall all day, but I really have been enjoying this wall. This wall is now my friend. Can you hear that? Can you hear that? Can you hear that? Yeah, I had like a really bad date the other day. Don't tell the guys that, cause I think he likes me. I feel like I can trust you now. Yeah, I definitely can trust you. You're like my favorite person to talk to. So like, what do you look like? They gave us so much free alcohol. I don't know why everyone's not taking, taking it up. Do you like going out? Cause I like going out sometimes. If I had a person, maybe wouldn't want to go out as much. But I haven't had a person in a while. You know, I've been, I've been single for a little bit now. I haven't met the right one, so I go out. I'm gonna try and meet him. And then it just doesn't work out. Yeah, do you relate at all? Ugh. I I feel like I just go out to like try and meet somebody and then I don't end up meeting anybody. You guys are my only friends in this. And you, you are also my friend and I think we could end up together. Oh. Can you not talk as loud? I really like talking with you, but you're just talking a little loud. And I, I drank a little bit too much with the girls last night, so I'm a little hungover. Damn, do those women know how to put away their alcohol? It's all free, so they just drink like there's no tomorrow. One perk. I mean, meeting our husbands is the other perk, obviously. I'm not... That's why I'm here. So today I'm gonna really try hard to pay attention. Some days I've gotten a little distracted. But I'm really committed to trying to make it work and I'm gonna ask a lot of questions. Hopefully we bond on them. Maybe, fingers crossed, I'll get a proposal by the end of it. Where did you say you're from again? That's actually not too far away from me. And what's your favorite movie? No way, mine is too. Oh my gosh. And what did you say you do for a living again? Wow, I'm in the same industry. We have so much in common. Is it, is it bad to say I, I think you're my favorite? Oh. You did this to say you're getting serious with someone else? Okay. No, no, it's okay. I understand. I'll just, I'll just be out. So apparently, he had another favorite and he didn't propose. So I don't get to go to Mexico now. I mean, yeah, I'm upset about, I'm upset about the proposal, but Mexico, free trip. Oh, I really wanted to be 
vacation. <laughs> I just, I can't. So describe how you look for me. I hope the producers made a good choice. Did you notice that every single person on the show is conventionally attractive? Even though the show is supposed to be all about how love is blind? What's the point then? No one would be that disappointed with their match. I mean, yeah, everyone has their type, but it's not like someone was going to be like shocked by how this person looked. Oh, oh, uh, I was taking notes.